Hey guys, today we got a cab high fiberglass 100R by Lear. Fits the 14 to 18 Chevy GMC trucks with a six and a half foot bed. White in color, pretty decent unit. Um, has some minor paint blemishes, a couple small, it's not really scratches, they're more like, I don't even know. We'll call them chips. I'm not sure that they are, they're on the outside of the paint, they probably would come off. Top, the top edge looks good. Front edge looks nice. A fly on there. That's a couple minor chips on the bottom edge. It's set on the ground. Some minor chips there. A little bit of a scratch there, back there. It's been this side's been worked out of. They've worked in and out of this door here. Uh, as you can see, the paint's kind of chewed up a little bit from dragging stuff in and out. So this has a cargo door, a wind, what they call a wind door. It's two handles opens up, allows access inside the uh, cap from the from outside here. Uh, you can see, like here, this has been wore across there, but that does doesn't affect anything. The seal's still there. Nothing's fine, but. tools in there and twist the handles like so, lock it up, and away we go. Double T-handle window on the side. Picture window front. Paint looks good in the front here. All the way through here. Down through there. Front edge. Always, almost always looks nice because doesn't get a lot of road debris because of the truck cab blocks it. Some minor chips on the corner right there. It looks good through there. It does have a couple scratches right there. A little chip right there and then a couple scratches right there. Paint looks good on the top. The top side here. Couple minor scratches right through there. Couple scuffs on the top. I'm not really sure. Maybe something was laid up there. Paint looks good through there. Couple minor chips on the bottom edge. Like I said, I'm pretty sure this one looks like it was set right on the ground. Chipped the edge up. This door wasn't used as much as the other door. You can tell there's there's a lot less. Um, scraping on the, the paint edge of the door. But same thing, it has a T-handle that twists there. Twists there. Opens up, allows access inside the cap. So put your camping gear in there or what have you. Close that up. Lock that up. Secure and ready to go. Double T-handle locking rear door. There's a couple minor chips right here in the corner there, some scratches, a little scuff right there. You see a little bit of a scuff right there too. See real major. Paint looks good over here and then a little bit of a minor chip there on the edge. Carpeted interior inside. Fuse box has a light switch for the dome light. Um, it used to have a 20 inch dome light. It looks like 20 inch LED. Somebody took the dome light out and left the wiring in there for it. So. In theory, this should work if you put a dome light up there. Serial number, 100RCC66GS14, so six and a half foot, 
GM truck, 14 to 18 body style. Code 50 white, so it's a standard Summit white. It does have, uh, hard to see these. It's got little laminated plates in the ceiling there that you could uh, use to uh, attach stuff to the ceiling. Those aren't always in there. Those are mounting points for something. There it is, cab high, fiberglass, Lear 100 RCC, commercial cap. It's a 14 to 18 Chevy GMC trucks with the six and a half foot bed. Uh, also the 15, um, 15 to 19, uh, 2500, 3500 truck beds with the six and a half foot bed also. The heavy duty 2500, 3500 trucks. Um, so 14 to 18 on the 1500s, 15 to 19 on the 25, 3500s. Um, Code Summit White in color. Below is a link to this unit on our website. So you can click that link, see which location it is, how much it is, purchase it online, make arrangements to pick it up online. That can all be done from that link there. There's also a link to our website in general. So if you're just looking for cap repair parts, clamps, tapes, seals, locks, bed storage solutions, ladder racks, you can get those. Click that link and type in a search bar what you're looking for, and those will all be purchased online from us as well. If you're looking for something specific for your truck, you're waiting to get one in for yours, um, we upload to YouTube and our website whenever we get inventory in. So you'll want to subscribe below to keep up to date on what's coming in as we get it. As with all our truck caps, they're local pickup only. We do not ship these. You'll need to make arrangements to pick these up at one of our locations. Thanks for watching.